I feel good, you know, I've just maintained that, you know, just like when you have a car, you have to, you have to service the car, so my duty is to make sure that my body is fine tuned and service and always ready for the go. And you know, the key focus is just always to stay healthy. I don't think it matters about the time right now, it matters about you getting heat races and to stay fit and healthy. And once I have that, you know, the time will come after. But you know, definitely the aim is always to try to break a world record, defend my title. But my focus right now is to just stay fit, stay healthy, take it race by race season by season yeah. great you know my schedule has changed you know different system different coaching i'm just trying to be accustomed to that and i'm thinking i'm in a good place right now and i'm really happy about that um all the pressure comes in when i'm having, a, having an injury you know the pressure is trying to say okay how do i fix this injury fast to make it to the olympics and to make it to the olympics we have to go to national trials and once i have that ready i think i'm good but for now just stay focused and healthy I do, I shot myself because most times it's not that you don't believe in yourself or you don't have confidence, it's just because of the setbacks you have and the struggles. And sometimes your body are not responding to the mind because most times I feel awful and when I do feel awful, it's almost like, okay, I get a fast time. And I would not say it's not supposed to feel good because feeling good is fine, but most times when I run the I, I think because your mind think too much when I think around the worst race is the fastest because I tell everybody at Eugene I wasn't feeling at my top I wasn't feeling good but I crossed and I was like oh no I didn't nail that start I don't think I start good but I feel awful but seeing 10 5 4 it was like okay I think I need to feel awful more but sometimes it's all about feeling good Nothing wrong with having nerves or to, you know, have a little slight doubt, but you don't want to doubt yourself all the time. But for me, I do shock myself most of the time, and I love the shocking myself. <laughs> you feel like you're going to shock yourself again this year? Let's just see what happens. <laughs> Thanks so much, Elaine. All right. Welcome to Sports Soccer 345. It was good hearing from Elaine Thompson era that she was in good health and she's ready to run fast. There was talk on the internet last week that she was injured and uh, that she a specialist was here to attend to her and uh, her fans started worrying but it was good hearing this um, report that she is in very good nick and she is healthy and she is strong sports soccer tv want to wish elaine thompson well this 2024 season and also this is an olympic year and she's a defending, double defending Olympic champion in both the 200 and the 100 meters. We wish her well and I hope that she will hold the mantle and the banner of Jamaica flag high and run fast. Keep it locked to Sports Circuit 345 for your news, views and reviews. And remember to subscribe to the channel before you leave. God bless.